not that I don't like anything big and black, but like a big black Cayman would take me out. <gasps> Jake, when it definitely moved. No, it definitely moved. I didn't see. Oh my God, I still cannot touch. I can't touch the bottom. I'm standing on a tree, which God knows what's underneath me right now. Probably hundreds of big piranha. How you feeling, Daddy? Morning shot. We're all dying, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Amazon. That's actually a good way to put it. Yeah, Kyle's got all these boils all over his legs from these bug bites. I have bites all over my body, and I'm wearing, I'm fully covered every day. 24-7. I don't know where it comes from. I think I get them in my sleep, so that's not good. Dude, I want to pop oh, that. No, stop. I want to pop it. Don't pop it. I want to, no. I've had them everywhere, though. I don't know what that is. What wow. the heck? What the heck? <laughs> dude, like, we got to get out of this jungle bro <laughs> boat to get back still isn't here and i haven't even told you guys why it left but in the midst of all of that we're gonna go try and catch fish after i drink this cup of coffee Got a fish on right here. I've pre-named him Armando. Oh, huge one behind it. Huge one. It's terrified. Oh Look how goodness. scared my fish oh is. Oh my goodness. Wait, I think my fish just got eight. My fish just got eight. Holy, I don't know if he got, oh, my fish just got grabbed and annihilated. What just happened? I think, he, I think he may have got out of the other one's mouth through the boil came behind it, grabbed him. Oh, oh yeah, that's oh my a gosh. bigger what fish. Just what just happened? Yeah, dude, something bigger has my line now. Dude, I think my fish just got absolutely mauled. That or he's still terrified because he's getting chased. Dude, oh, poor oh. guy. I'm so sorry, dude. He got eaten. That fish is enormous. Dude. What? What? Dude, I'm so hard. I, have a, I had a way smaller fish. This fish mauled that one and took the lure from it, like mid-go. That's not a small fish at all. Dude, you wanna smell him? Smell him. There you go, guys. There you go. Hopefully, everyone just tag me if you sniffed your sc your screen. That's so weird. That's I'm so this weird. poor generation, dude. How Twelve good. and a half. <laughs> That's awesome. All right. Oh my God. Twelve and a half to start the morning. Mm, mm, mm. What the hell was even that? Dude. <laughs> All right, buddy. Wait. Yeah. All right. Dude, so that's nuts. My, it, like, I had a little one, and that guy just went, <laughs> hooked a bait from him. Wow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So our boats are gone. I just finished editing the video that just dropped, which if you haven't watched it, by the way, you're a loser. Uh, you know what's actually funny is I'm joking when I say that, but I've seen some comments where people take that literally. Yes. I saw someone on one video, by the way, I read the comments, who was like, I would say Brenton should have a million subscribers, but he's actually really mean to us. Like he made a comment about how he would never come. Was it Wisconsin? Uh, it was something like uh, that, bro. Well, you're right, I wouldn't. I don't want to go to Wisconsin. And there's probably a lot of people who don't want to go to Texas either, yep. okay, which is fine. No, so because all of the boats are gone, which there is one boat, but that's, yes. a, that's a travel luggage boat. I wanted to find another way to catch a fish. There's not anything biting off of the bank, so I'm gonna take it into my own hands make a little bit of a fish trap Did I just did I just glitch? I think I just glitched Did you make a little bit of a fish trap and not like a primitive one like I saw this picture on YouTube a while ago I'm gonna try and remake it I don't really know what it does, but it looks cool and we're gonna see if we can catch something Let me tell you walking in here is by far not the brightest idea on the planet at all Especially with no shoes and no shirt and also everything does want to kill you inside of this jungle. You got poked by something? Yeah, everything also wants to poke you. Look at it in here. Oh, oh. oh that's painful. Okay, this is what it looks like in the it's multiple different types of sticks. We have poison ivy back in the States. I have no idea what they have here. Go. Okay. All right. I need this. I need one more thing. Uh, let's see. This will work. Okay. Should be good to go. By the way, there's like ants and bugs that fall on me, and they're they're huge. I don't know if they're bullet ants or not. Which, by the way, that would suck. There's they're everywhere here. If I got bit by a bullet ant, I would be extremely disappointed <laughs> because that would be incredibly painful. <laughs> also, wearing no shirt is an awful idea. And no shoes, B. And no shoes. <laughs> Everything does want to kill you. Anyways. Everything. Not only that, the locals across. I saw a jaguar this morning. A jaguar, isn't that so cool? No. Oh 
Oh my god, dude. What even is in this jungle? I'm just walking out and whatever that is just goes directly into my oh hand. Oh my goodness. And it was like in my in my hand, and now my hand's on fire. So this is a whole like river system. It looks crazy from a drone. Looks insane. Yeah. But it's full of a few different types of things. Massive peacock bass. We're talking like 15, 16 pound peacock bass. Massive peacock bass. Black piranhas, which by the way are like the mean piranhas. Not red belly, black piranha. And then wolf fish, which by the way, I saw this video on YouTube one time of a wolf fish degloving somebody's finger and uh it got removed for obvious reasons, but I remember seeing it. <laughs> this is where we're making the trap. As you guys know, we just went to Home Depot to get our supplies. <laughs> it's like a regular video. Art. <laughs> That's what it's called. It is just called art. Now we need like six bottles. And by the way, everything, it's probably like, it's very shallow right there. That does not matter here, it okay, doesn't. in the Amazon. That is not a factor. You know what shallow? Bait fish. Yep. You know what eat all the bait fish? Every mean thing, every, not mean, it could be a very docile fish, and it'll still kill anything it sees. But let's be real, majority of the fish in the Amazon are very mean. Including the grass. All right, that's our base right there. By the way, I have to use wire for all of this because, by the way, everything also has teeth. It's actual knottable wire. Uh, yeah, this is actually what we use like for garbage. So <laughs> stuff goodness. can't bite through it. And then all you do is put it in here, and because it's wire, it's thick. So whenever you screw the cap on, it's got this little lining over the wire that like cinches down. So whenever you do that, yeah, I'm breaking the cap off before I pull that out. Okay, there's three bottles done. so insanely focused right now because it's about to be dark and not that like we're in a rush to catch the fish i'm just in a rush to finish the trap and uh honestly i hate being out here at night it's terrifying yeah. <laughs> so that is not as many bottles as i want but four is enough for right now you never know by the end of this video we could extend it to like 25 bottles <laughs> and we could catch everything in the river oh, okay. Who is that? so cool so cool that i literally they're all as tangled as you could possibly imagine. And it, yes, and it's all also wire. Oh my god, dude, I can't even figure that out. How do you even, what do I even do about all of that? It's funny because all of the, like, the indigenous people here, they have absolutely zero clue what I'm doing. Uh, <laughs> they're very interested though. They were interested enough when I took their machete. The, I'm sure all of these bottles and whatever we catch will be gone and completely consumed by the morning because I've already caught catfish bait. And they ate it all before I even like, got the chance to get it. This, yeah, this would be the last one if I can find the, uh, well, that's, that's not good. You're probably wondering what's the purpose of the bottles. Th it has a purpose, all right, I swear, it does. Just give me a second to my brain to come back. I got it, I got it. Just in case it falls off the stick, we can find the fish later. That's the purpose. You know, the scariest part is I just thought about it, it's like, there could be an anaconda, right? Yes, there is. A there world is a, record anaconda. There's a lot of anacondas in here. Like, I mean, a lot. That's the crazy thing, is they saw a 15 meter one. I'm trying to think about how big 15 meters yeah. is and how many feet, but it's huge. And they said when it was, it ate, and it was like that big around, an anaconda. And then I asked if they attack people. I think we got a little bit of this discussion on camera, but I'm not even kidding. There was a guy who was running up a log out of the river and an anaconda grabbed his calf. and it wrapped him around the log and crushed him. Yeah. I always thought like after watching Anaconda with Jennifer Lopez that like it's not really like that. It's like, <laughs> it's that. like they that. said they were, like anacondas aren't even afraid of people out here. It's like a thing someone got their arm latched onto and they said like the size of the anaconda's head was like someone's full chest. Can we can we talk about how the arm was gone? Oh yeah, his arm he had to cut it off so the anaconda didn't wrap around him and I'm not even joking. Man. That's a crazy thing and they're like I don't want to jinx it, but they're they're in here. <laughs> I just need to figure out what to put on these hooks, which they're like that. They should be able to catch pretty much anything. And then the bottle, we're gonna drop that right there. And like I said, there it's it's like knee deep right here. Anything and everything can live in knee deep water. Every time we walk, look at right there. Look at right there. Look at right there on the bank. Something is eating something, and I don't know what. But before it gets any darker and like the bugs actually get me, and I don't have malaria pills with me, uh, we're gonna go back to camp and see what, whatever we can even find to go on this. And maybe put it on there tonight and leave it 
through the night. Okay, I'm walking to camp right now. Jake one is currently asleep, so that's why I have my phone. I'm gonna put worms on the trap. That was just my update for what we're using as bait because I have I have my phone. But I'm gonna see you guys in the morning. That's what we're using as bait. Hey, Louis. The the sun did the. <laughs> it's not okay. Yeah, we're gonna go check the fish trap and see if we got anything. I mean, I, I literally kid you not. Oh, my hand's boiling when I when I put it out there. Oh god! Like it's it's so bad. I don't even wanna. Ah, ah, ah. Oh my god! Luckily, the trap is probably like probably 100, 150 yards in a river over there off the camp. Even like the locals are like wondering probably why we're walking right now. The sand. I don't have any feeling in my feet. You guys know this, but I can feel how hot it is. Butt cheeks clenched dude like it looks like you're in like the sahara desert right now not even no no oh we're missing a bottle oh my god wait there's only three we definitely put four on there 100 percent, we put four on there and there's no bait on the hooks took the bait. so something probably either got like stuck on it and then like just came off over time or took the bait but there's a there's a bottle right there that was a shallow bottle oh oh it's right there Oh, it's right there. The bottle's right there. It looks like it just came off. That's really like, that's really anticlimactic. Wow. I was feeling like testosterone rushing through my body when I was walking up here. It's all gone now. I flatlined. That's really dumb. It doesn't look like anything's on it. It doesn't look like anything's on it. It's just, I'll get it, but I don't think there's anything on it. I don't want to get anybody's hopes up. This is also just as bad of an idea. Walking into this river like, the, oh God, this is... Ooh, that's scary. That is scary. Okay. Oh my god, dude. That is actually terrifying. Imagine a big black caiman. Not that I like not that I don't like anything big and black, but like a big black caiman would take me out. Oh <gasps> Jake one, it definitely moved. No. It definitely moved. I didn't see. Oh my god, I still cannot touch. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh god! There is something on it. There's something on it. <laughs> no way, wait. That's cool. Okay. No 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 no. I can't touch the bottom. I'm standing on a tree, which God knows what's underneath me right now. Probably hundreds of big piranha. Come back. What is that? What is that? What is that? Huge black piranha. Huge black piranha. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. There's a massive black piranha. We caught a massive piranha. Oh, no, 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 not, not me, not me. No, 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 no. My biggest fear right there was him swimming towards me with his mouth open. That is a big, Fat Lizzo sized piranha. <laughs> oh my goodness. Wait till you see this thing's teeth. Wait till you see this. Bro, look at those. Dude, that takes a bite out of you. You're done. You're gone. You're done if that bites you. He doesn't want to bite it, so I'm just actually I'm flossing for him. I, I don't want to put my finger in there. Don't. Oh my gosh, dude. That is actually like kind of terrifying to look at. I won't lie. Imagine a hundred of these. You're in the water. You stand no chance. Zero. You stand no chance. And just like this guy, he stands no chance because I'm about to give him to Luis. <laughs> oh. Luis is our chef. I feel like Jeremy Wade walking out of the river right now in River Monsters with my with my dinner. Oh, mira. <laughs> Okay. Come on. See, I want to eat it. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. No. Yes. <laughs> we get to eat them. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna eat them up. I don't know what his name is. Um. Oh. 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 Bro. Um. My finger? No, 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 no. <laughs> Is uh no bueno. No, no. Okay, let's see how this tastes. I've never had a black piranha. <laughs> oh yeah! Oh, big dad! Oh my sure. god! Okay. That right there, um, this is the piranha we just caught. <laughs> and uh, his teeth, they're, they're still there. He's like extra dead. <laughs> I don't even know how to eat that. I have no idea how to eat that. Came up with the idea, Luis is gonna hang the piranha head on something so all the ants can eat all of the skin off of it. So it's just like completely white and then I can take it back home. I also named him Ryan. By the way, this trip, not going as planned. There's a lot of stuff that's gone down that I haven't even talked about yet, like people not here anymore. We almost medevaced out. Like there's stuff that has happened that we have filmed. That's why we're not fishing right now. But at least we got Ryan. Well, Ryan's in my stomach. Ryan is also in my stomach. <laughs> yeah. 
All right, guys, we're, it's finally nighttime. We've got one more day here after this. I don't think y'all understand like what we've been through. We just filmed a little bit of a fish trap, okay? <laughs> y'all don't know what really has been going on while we're here, and I'm gonna save that for the next video. I'm not even, I'm not even kidding. Like the consideration of meta medevacking out of here has has come up. Yes. Not even joking. I'll leave that for later, though. We got a we got a big fat black piranha. <laughs> Why does it black like that? No, click the subscribe button down below. Thank you, everyone. We are out here. I feel like I've been in a camp uh, and then I've just been destroyed and like mentally attacked over and over and over. I can't even imagine what it would be like to be home right now. That's how that's how weird of a feeling it is. So uh, click the subscribe button. And other than that, we got one more day tomorrow. I love you guys and I will see y'all in the morning. Peace. Look at this, guys, bro. The grass wants to kill you.